Hello, guys, and welcome back to another chess video. In the last episode, we did E, E4, but today we are doing D4. And there's some differences, probably the one of the main reasons why they're different is because d4 is defended by the queen, and when, and when the e4 is not defended by anything. And as the board said, 9 to f6 is the best move. And I think it's the best move to get the balance United to tell why from playing E4. And yeah. And then White responds with C3. Black responds with. Um, D5. And then, yeah. This is basically the opposite from E4. I can bring my bishop out. There are multiple different things that I can do. I, it says, it says, um, hate knight, hate five is a good move, but in my opinion, it's a bad move because if you have a knight in the center of the board, it can go to eight squares, different squares. But if it's on the edge or on the corner, it can't reach its full potential. So I think, I think black should play bishop. Bishop, Bishop, F5. A3 for white, A6 for black. And white should play Bishop F1 to B5. Attacking. Yeah, attacking the king, which is check. The best move is um, C, C6. I think it's a right move that attacks the bishop. Uh, but it also covers the most natural square for the knight, but next move. Black and play not to be eight two d seven. So um, black should play white. Rather should play d three. Mm, that's interesting. Knight to f six d four. White to play G G four attacking the bishop. That I don't know what black is playing here, but queen to D eight to H four. I don't know what black is playing here, but why it takes the knight on a4 trading trading and bishop to g3 forcing the knight now the queen away to f6 
and then white can trade get down it. I think white is winning here because his bishop is developed and um his pawns are doubled up on the e file. Why, why would the queen move over one? We don't know. White does not castle, surprisingly. Black wins his bishop out to e7. Knight to e2. Now, now they take. And he has to take back with his king because the knight blocked the queen. Now it says to play h5, take back. I understand why he's doing this to back up the queen with the rook, with the check, king to g2. Oh, yes. Check. Queen h3. Queen back to g1. Knight to b, b8 to d7. There's multiple moves that white can do, but queen to d1 to d3 looks like the best move. Now white, I think, knight to d7 to f6 is the best move. Knight to e2 to c3. Queen to h3 to d4. There's apparently king to g1 to g2 is the best move. I don't know how much longer I'm going to continue this line. Oh, I get it. He pinned his bishop on g3 because if he, he can't move the bishop because the king will be in check. And if they do trade bishops, the pawn can't take on g g3 because black rook on the h8 will take our rook on the h1, even though it's backed up, so it's kind of a train. But still, black moves out the way to f2. Black castles. White trains bishops on d6. White take back with the rook. I only move to take back. And now he brings his rook over to attack the queen. Apparently, king to f2 to f3 is the best move. Or, no, not anymore. He's basically moved the king. I have a case in check. Hmm. I did not realize that until it looked hard enough. Hard. Anyway. Yeah, black saw what I was trying to do. Apparently moving the queen to d3 to e, b, c4, 
Hello everyone. Queen of one attacking the rook. Rook back to d8. I'm, I'm not gonna. Oh, oh. I fork. He's in check. Actually, never mind, because the knight's protected by the queen. Would have been a good fork guy. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. Black did not go for the trade of queens, but why does? This is a Hang on. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, what is that a pawn? Interesting. Why would black give a I say it's not that afraid because black king what? Oh, I get it. black. We're gonna double up. A smart kid now. Yeah, smart, yeah, but why gets the pawn back anyway? Um, yeah, yeah, and this is a line that, that white and black would be on if they did D, D4. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm so happy that I found this website. But I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe if you new. Like the video if you enjoyed it. And see you in the next video. Goodbye.